Welcome back to Divinity Original. Uh, fuck this fight. Uh, it was it was it was amazing. We did it. It was completely epic. Uh, ignore the fact that it appears to have completely been reset. We we obviously did it. Uh, I, I, See, we kept beating it, but it kept resetting. It was weird. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's a bug game mechanics. Um, actually, I don't want to go here, do I? Actually, I do want to go here. So uh, the very first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get rid of this chicken motherfucker because. Uh, uh, yeah, he's, um, he's our special friend, and, uh, I had to look up how to get rid of him, because he was actually fucking over the fight, because we basically kept, like, not getting him for the quest, so. Uh, I think, actually, they told me what to do with him. But that's, I think, the very first thing we're gonna do. No, you lead the way, boss. Well, I'm going back to where we found the chickens. Apparently, you're supposed to use uh, the source thing and fucking talk to the ghost of Marge. I don't know if we did that. I don't think we did. Well, you know, I never would have thought of speaking to the ghost of a chicken. I mean, neither did I. Monster! Monster! Poor little Peepa! Poor little monster Peepa, baby! There's only one way! Yes, there's only one awk, awk thing to do! Papa! Uh, okay, what's Papa? Does she be Peeper's father? Yes, yes, yes! He wanders, he roars, roosts, but he is special. He can help Peeper, can keep him <laughs> safe. Well, he's a, he's a dead deadbeat dad. <laughs> he fucking left. Um, uh, ask if you shouldn't put the chick out of its misery. He seems it seems dangerous. What? The people won't stop following you, but you, uh, it seems to think you're its mother. Then you'd better be the best mama you can be. Care for Peeper and stroke him and bring him straight to his papa. I'm going to stroke nothing. Alright, so... Where's the Countess? Um, so let me read, read the logbook. It says... Uh, a special rooster might be able to help the chick. Doesn't show us where to go for this? I I don't know. I don't think so. Alright, I love this chicken so much. Oh no, magic rooster. There it is. Oh yeah, I see it too. Uh okay, how do how do we want to get over there? I guess back to Paladin Bridgehead and then we'll just go. A little bit left from there. That seems I pretty guess. good. Yeah. I, I don't know why you're walking. Because I like using my legs. Yeah, fuck off. I've had enough fucking walking. Walking can go suck it. Hey, you know what? What? Hey, girl. I don't know what. You're just gonna, you see, in this game, you can't spam teleporter pyramids. You see anymore? They fixed it. I know that. it's sad. They fixed it. They fixed it. It's fucking over. No more poof. It, you just kind of weirdly appear there. All right, where, how far are we from this thing? All right, so there's there's like four fuckers down here. Oh, there's there's deer here. Not steer deer. Void touch deer. Oh god. Oh, okay, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna avoid that. Uh, Level 14? Yeah, we're super gonna avoid that. Let me just get rid of the fucking chicken first. This thing's a piece of shit. <clears throat> we're almost there. Cause that thing Stay I didn't on target. So okay, so for anyone who is isn't aware, the way this works is this chicken is following me around and whenever we load it appears next to me, regardless of where it was in the fight before the save. And so we were just surrounded by Necrofire, and people would die every time, so we're like, okay, we have to do this without fucking loading. Which is obviously a very, uh, unfortunate circumstance, but yes, here's level 2 Peeper. Or whatever, fucking Magic Cockerel. Behold, ho, Heracocco! Behold, it is I, the Magic Cockerel! Waka! What is this? Papa? 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 Uh, Magic Cocker, remind yourself to find out more about th that later. Well, 
Uh, tell him that this is the son of Big Marge and he's, uh, though she, she's dearly departed now. Marge? Marge! Oh, Marge! She was a good sort! I'll mourn her with my mourning! Go, 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 go! <laughs> I, I, someone had fun with the voice acting here. The rooster looks his son over, first with one beady eye, then the other. I see nothing but the void lurking behind those pretty peepers. Kill him now or he will get, get, go! Kill us all later. Papa? Alright. Should we kill him or no? We can. Let's kill him. Yeah, okay. Wink and say you'll take care of peeper. Good choice. Good choice. Oh, guys. And I'll give you a little something for your trouble after. Alright. <laughs> well, I can get a bow. Yeah, this is garbage. Yeah, okay, but like, yeah, but like, he get, I, I guess the chicken gives us stuff when we kill him. Uh, so it gives us also, I took it also. Uh, so do you want, do you want strength pants or do you want a helm for intelligence, which is 29 magic armor, 5 physical, level 9? Mom is pretty good right now. What about the pants, though? Strength. I, I, that, they're the only thing that, that's worthwhile, except for medium water resistance potion. The pants I mean, are... My current, my current pants on beast to level 6 pants. Okay. Well, hopefully that does it. Alright. <laughs> Not that much better, but I guess. Well, okay, well, there's much better stuff in this chest, actually. I mean, we didn't even kill him yet. Right, why are we no, getting the dead. rewards now? Oh. I thought we were supposed to fight stuff. <laughs> okay. Uh, axe, uh, Dwarven Staff, Water Arrow. we will give that to Sabeel. Oh, I'll take that. Alright, well, have fun with that. That's probably what we need for that fight on the fucking rooftop. We need, like, fucking fire resistance potions or some kind of spell for fire resistance or something. Yeah, but it had to be something that would last, but you're right. I was I was thinking about it, I was like, that would help. I'm giving Beast the fucking pants. Okay, I'm still in this stuff. I mean, it, this may, this reward may not be worth, but who cares, because we got rid of the fucking chicken. No, I guess the axe is better than what I'm currently using. Like, the one I'm using is a closed circuit, but we don't... That's like magic, magic armor and shit. One second, I'm going to sadly wonder if you really did the right thing by killing poor Peeper. About that abomination, aren't you distracted by the tuk, 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 trinkets I gave you in return? That's all you rock adventurers care about, no? Get your flapping out of my beak. <laughs> I wonder if we could talk to the ghost of Peeper. The answer is no. All right. Well, you see, his steamed voice actor like Peeper, you can't afford that. <laughs> the best voice actor. I see some shit down here. Well, <clears throat> so I want to go towards the 420 herb, so... You want to join me on that glorious adventure? Sure, I'll, I'll catch up. Alright. Take Sabeel with you. I'm I don't joking. want Sabeel. Before you lies a primitive altar to the Seven, apparently constructed during a bygone era. Something about it appeals to you. A faint heat emanating from the stones, perhaps. Kneel before the altar and offer a prayer. The air stirs, as though someone had appeared and taken a seat upon the altar. A voice rises around you, its source unclear. Fractured whispers surround you. God woken. The word flutters against your ear. You are my champion. You cannot fail. A jolting sensation pierces your heart. As the shock fades, you realize you've absorbed a modicum of source, seemingly from the air around you. The whispers shuffle away, and the air shifts. Whatever was here a moment ago is gone now. All right. The altar lies in sight. Yeah, it's it, it's a gave me free source, but I didn't need it, so. It also gave you some experience. I'm gonna kneel and do the same thing. All right. Ah. Oh. Yeah, like four thousand experience. Come on, it's bought. <laughs> Uh, this is a very interesting, uh, uh, I love the piece of chest. 
It says, reflect 10% of melee damage, air damage, has a bunch of physical ma magic armor, finesse 12, sets silenced. Oh. I think she well, just... means you can't cast spells, so... Yeah. I just... <clears throat> no more no more spells anymore. It's 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 called the 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 very very silent watcher's leather shirt. <laughs> I want my spells though. I'm gonna I'm gonna just approach this, see what happens. The house? Oh yeah, there's a house here. here Spooky spiderwebs. Ah. Oh. It has been some time since people have been here. What's this thing? Junk. Why did I just pick up fucking broken bottle? Why didn't I see it with alt? Uh, fucking. Oh, pick. wood pulp. You want pulp? Oh, there's a backpack here. There's nothing in it. Dude, let me tell you, this uh house is exciting. Is it? I. It doesn't really seem that exciting to me. Right, oh, wait, man, there's these vases over here. I'm going to bed, good night. I'm fucking tired. It's broken. <clears throat> oh, dude, gloves! Are you ready to go, Sunshine? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I feel like we should have done something with that deer encounter, to be honest, before we forget about we it. We can always go back and. <laughs> try... Alright then. Let's go back and. Let's fucking... go fucking die to level 14 deer. I'm trying to debate the best way of getting back there. I'll just fucking walk walk there. Damn straight you will. I just wanted to get rid of Peeper. Fuck Peeper so much. Like, the reward wasn't even that good. We were restarting the fight for that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, maybe we... Uh, I don't know. I said, if maybe you we could have gotten the other reward, but fuck it. I'm happy what we got. What was the source orb that we got? Just a source orb. Like, we, we, I, I'm sure I've told you like three times now. They don't do, they don't do much? They might be used for crafting. I think. I think they are used for crafting. Oh, I see. Okay. But they give you like the like the runes. They give you a bunch of abilities. Uh, let me let me save before like, we uh have... before you fucking lose. Yeah. I don't know why they're hanging out with the void touch deer. Four deer stand in formation near a crumbling altar. Three stags, fawn colored and hearty, gaze cloudy eyed at a great black skeleton glowing an eerie green. Now. No. No. Interject, that deer looks void woken. The three fawn colored stags shake their antlers. The clouds clear from their eyes. Huh? What? Where are we? You vermin. Always treading where you are least wanted. Enough. Time to fight fucking void woken deer. You want to put Seville back on the high ground there? Yeah, <laughs> no, I'm, I'm on that. <clears throat> All right, go go cast your shit. Why is why, beast get back down there? Why is beast fucking coming down here, fucking pussy? Oh, looks like the deer are gonna help us. Ah, oh, you lost. Stop it! Why did I lose? Why is that like? Sh what you fucking <laughs> shaming to anything these days? <laughs> Used to courage. Use haste. He's bullying me. Why do you fucking use haste on this thing? Because he's not in the combat right now. Oh, which means it's expiring now. Well, I mean, like, he's not currently in melee, so, like, oh, yeah, haste him. So he has a point to use to get into melee. Okay. Go get him. Get him. Yeah, I plan on it. This is, like, my favorite feature there, of like this a... game, to be honest. Fucking shame pinging? Yeah. So I should have done the rain stack first, but I already wasted it. Hey girl. Hey girl. <laughs> I don't let's not kill the deers. Let's just are we in agreement? I mean why would I kill the deers? Cause your AoE shit will splash to them. I'm I mean I am offended that you would think that I would splash to them or something. Prepare yourself. <laughs> Got him. Alright, I'm gonna save the rest of my points though. These DS are very important characters. They're very dear to my heart. Maybe I should have made, like. Sibyl should have sucked some blood. It's 
fine. All right. Eh. Prepare yourself. What? I didn't Did hurt, hurt them. The deer? No, they're friendly. It never hurts the, the friendly. They're neutral for me. Oh, they're green. Because remember, like the the match, the matches in the other fight were also neutral, and I hurt them. I don't know. Maybe, maybe you're just a shit stain. I don't fucking know. Maybe you're a shit stain piece they're, of shit. They're green, so I just assumed that they wouldn't hurt them. They're yellow for me. Oh, but these appear yellow. I'm oh, sorry. These appear green though, right now. Green outline. Like, I'm just gonna play it safe then. Yeah, I think maybe. Yeah, magisters would be yellow. You can choose to fight them, but these are deer. They're green. They're actually friendly. They are yellow to me, so I'm gonna be very careful with my AOE. Well, As in, I'm not gonna maybe, AOE. Maybe that's the thing with you. Oh, that's because I have pet pal. Maybe. Maybe. My 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 party has pet pals. So like, either way, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna try it. Because technically, I initiated this this engagement, so they're like I'm defending them, but you're not. You're just kind of here for the ride. It's just not gonna matter. It's not gonna touch them. It's gonna be fine. Oh dear, do it. Ah, uh, you got the last hit. Okay, is that it? Is it, is it really dead? I feel I've got a tumbleweed where my thinker nut used to be. If you hadn't come when you did, I might be like that thing. Thank my lucky antler, you came when you did. Yeah, they're very nice to us. Alright, so, what do you have? Uh, he had a saucer bottom, which is, you know, so we're already making up for things you might have lost. <laughs> uh, he also had an antler. Oh. Uh, the, the deers probably also have antlers, but let's not massacre the deer. I don't mean to fawn, but without you, that thing would have... I forget how you craft this as, like, well, a knife. I don't know, but I'm glad I didn't find out. I, I don't feel remember like either. I could eat a whole bloody like, I'll get it eventually. I'm just gonna combine it with shift. The ancient altar before yeah, which the deer crowded sits stark in the dappled forest light. Something about it draws you in. It seems to emit a faint, pleasing heat. Uh, kneel before the altar and offer a prayer. The air stirs, as though someone had appeared and taken a seat upon the altar. A voice rises around you, its source unclear. Fractured whispers surround you. Ha, hurry. Okay. The altar lies in silence. Yeah, that's done then. The stag nuzzles you, its soft, downy snout pressed into your side. Snuggle friend, donkey, on the double. <laughs> Alright, uh, is this a deer? I'm not sure. Alright, let's, um... Uh, I, I, I would say let's go back to... I don't know where. We we, we definitely want to go... Oh, we actually found Driftwood Fields. Did we actually find the waypoint, though? No, we didn't, oh. actually. What? Oh, you found a chest? I found a, I found a holy hand grenade. It was just sitting out in the open. It's like... Come on, Mike. You found it. It, it was hidden, you're right. I dug it up, but didn't ask. What, 1,000 years? Mm -hmm. I, uh, I have a holy hand grenade now. Where it leads. There's some people There's here. Better than here. I'm gonna talk maybe. to them. The couple notice you approach. The man offers a cheery smile. The woman watches you a little more warily, her arms crossed in front of her. Greetings. Greetings. Uh, I admire the choice of camping spot. Ask where they're headed. The open road. And a new life at the end of it, hopefully. Fulton, our business is our business. Remember what Carl Van told us. The man nods, chastened. We don't know where we're going, but we are definitely not going back. There's no reason for anyone to go back where we came from unless they have a death wish. Death wish? Are they fleeing? We heard that our homes are likely gone. For we'd woken. We'd be dead with everyone there if we weren't forced to meet in secret. Fulton's a sorcerer. I don't care about that. I love him. But too many people from where we come from would care. They yeah, They were just stuck in their ways. Afraid of what's being said about people like me. Well, they're all dead now. And they can't stop us being together. The Void Woken are welcome to this place. I uh, wish them happiness and... start a new uh, life. Wish them happiness and good luck and take your leave. All right. Why are we here? Uh, well, because I want to go up the... I want to go, like, to this house and shit. So. Oh, wait, we want to explore kind of closer to the island here. Sorry, where did you want to go? Just fucking follow me, you piece of shit. 
Alright, All right, set turn. me free. Oh, dude, short bow. That actually sells for a lot. I'm gonna get that. Does it actually? It sells for 400 gold. It's like, it's, that's not Fuck. bad. You have an eye for these things, clearly. It's called alt. There's a chicken here. I wanna go attack the chicken. Or, no, wait, that's bad juju. Or there's a cat. I actually can't tell if there's something here. Oh, there it is. Maybe that's a cat? I can't actually fucking tell. My eyes hurt right now. Oh, it's a squirrel. The little squirrel cowers oh, dude, there's a leafy frond, peeping up at you through liquidy eyes that tremble with terror. What's here? This is a talking scarecrow. Alright, well, I'll talk to you in a second. Yeah, there's a bridge troll somewhere. Talking scarecrow. Yeah, it's a uh, restless scarecrow. Is well, I mean, it's pretty good scarecrow. Smells void woken to me. Everything smells void woken to you. Fuck, where's my demons? This fucking rabbit. All right, whatever. I'm not talking, talking to the rabbit. It's too much effort. I see the key to the witch's house. Let's do the scarecrow first. Level 12. Red Prince, greatest of royals, greatest of kings to be. Do stay with me here for a while. Take a rest from the weary road. A great pounding suddenly erupts in your chest. Your inner god roars and bellows, an incoherent, maddening cacophony. It is awful how she treats you. She asks so much and gives so little in return. I wonder who she that is referred to who doesn't speak of. The one who makes demands, of course. The one who cowers inside you even now, afraid to face me. Yeah, it's the god. Your god thrashes and recoils inside you. You feel your heart somersault and a lone word hissed in your inner ear. Void. Demand to know who you're talking to, who you're really talking to. I am the only one who cares. She will say otherwise. She always does. And in the end, she'll betray you. Don't play her game. Think of yourself. Rest here. The sun is golden. No one will bother you. This moment can last forever. If you let it. A sudden weariness washes over, bone deep and as irresistible as a strong current. Uh, grit your teeth, b bunch your fists, fight back, resist the urge to just lie down and give up. The fatigue ebbs away. So I had to, I had to convince myself. <laughs> Alright. Sure, but I didn't talk to him. Yeah. Then surges back. Shh, don't fight it. This is how it's supposed to be. Sleep now. When you wake, it will be in a new world. A beautiful world. Resist. <sighs> I only wanted to give you rest, not pain. Now, I leave you to my children. They are many. They are impatient. They lack my gentle touch. I am sorry. Truly. Well. Uh, I, 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 for no reason whatsoever, I'm gonna bring Sibyl up on the diagram. I'm actually gonna leave Beast up here, because I got the feeling I'm gonna get surrounded. I don't really want to- I don't really want to put- like blood up here, but whatever, fine. I'm starting it. Hey, look at that! I was right. Terror aura. Fuck. He's evading now. Oh. All right, I'm gonna deploy my dude. Prepare. I'm not sure if I can see you. If I can, I'll give you some magic armor. Red Prince is terrified anyways. Yeah, but if I give him magic, I'm gonna get all resistant. Okay. Oh, it's cured by clear minded and rage, but you only got it because of his aura. So what if I give you magic armor? Uh Let's find out. Yep, yeah, no, I'm still terrified. Well you can you can Oh actually. I mean there's no status effect on it. That's the thing. I have a scroll for this. Terrified, blocked by magic armor. 
Oh, I see. So we're Cause it's, it's constantly the... trying to apply it to us, I see. Yes, so that's why you need magic uh, armor. Okay. I think we should focus down the big dude. Uh, he's evading right now. Hmm, fair point. I mean, teleport um, him away. <laughs> well, I, I spent my turn to getting you back in the fight. That's uh, true, but yeah. I'm going to delay my turn with big dude here, see what happens. Uh, so it looks like they're all going to do that range bullshit. Yeah. But they don't have a lot of armor. No, which means you can CC them pretty well. Although I can't do enough damage to CC them properly. I can do this though. How much does this do? Not enough, okay. I mean, even if you get this terrified... This going to bounce. I'm not even going to bounce even, but... Just start CCing them. How do you knock down a Scarecrow? Oh, now you're terrified. That's fine. Alright. Sabeel will... Start hitting some of these ones from range. Now here's the thing, I can I can use knockdown arrow on that one. Probably not a bad idea, honestly. The thing is they're actually really fragile, so. Uh, let's see. I wanna kinda hit that wanna hit that one. Let's see. And then hit do battle stomp. That's the spirit. Alright. Cause if we just wait the one turn, then he will stop evading, and then we can just shit fuck his entire family. And then we fucking won. Tell what I can do with my turn. I can't I don't want to attack, but I can go stand next to him. Cause I think he'll then try and move and I think it'll wear off and I'll be able to hit him. Let's just see what happens. Motherfucker. <laughs> good, 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 good stuff. Source vampire. No, my source point. Whoa. Alright. Alright, so is he. He's not evading anymore, so. I probably should not be so terrified, though. Uh, I'm trying to think. Do I have anything to give you magic armor? Not sure that you do. I mean, I could probably blow him up, though. I'll yield to none. Yeah. All right. Hopefully, now you're Sabiel. terrified. Now Sabiel is terrified. Okay. Well, I think we'll just run out of the fight. Let's see. Let's see what happens during our turns. No, they just don't do anything. I bet, but he is kind of running away, I guess. Oh, you're dead also. I've been dead. Yeah, that's not good, because we just don't get to do anything. Okay, yeah, this fight's over. Yeah, we just lose. Uh, I, I, You may not like where I have this save, because I don't like where I have this save. Does Ethan have a turn? Uh, uh, no, as in, like, it's way before. Like, oh fucking hell! Before the fight, actually, it was when I last quick saved, which was the deer fight. I didn't think to save it during the the thing. Well, that's not too bad. I thought for a second I thought you were gonna say we lost and we're all the way back at the start. No, because I've been quick saving it since then. And I think all I would do differently is I would spend my points teleporting my way. Uh, yeah, that's probably not a bad idea. Uh, wait, where is this? Yeah, this is just before we did this <laughs> engagement. Okay, uh, we'll be back in a bit, guys. Four deer st No, no. The three. F what? Oh. I, don't, I don't even care because this fight was easy. Why is Sibyl still running into the fight? Man, 
now would like the moment to set it up, but I guess fuck me, right? Yeah. Prepare yourself. Dude, he's got like no armor. I'll yield to none. We just did this, and then we went across the ways, and then yeah, that was it. Get him, dude. Yep. Fuck him up. Oh wait, the deers by. Oh, dude. What? They default applied knockdown. The deers. Oh, neat. But he's not knocked down right now. Well, yeah, like it, just, it failed because he's still physicama. Get him. Don't worry. I get him. Was it me? Oh, thank god. Fuck. Technically you should use Bull Rush to uh, maximize your damage there. I'll do whatever I want. Alright, let me just uh, shame ping Sabeel. Being out of position. You mean in position? Just whatever. El Haste. I can't punch myself. Oh, the deer are yelling at me now, too. Or maybe they. Maybe it's all relative, who knows. Be very, very careful. Knockdown failed. <laughs> they must have a chance to apply it. Or maybe just to apply it always, I don't know. I'm just, I'm not gonna attack. I'm probably gonna bounce my shield. Well, why am I missing an AP point? Whatever. Another, wait. They, they were only green to red prince, I guess. I, as I said, I think it was because I was talking to them, but whatever. Alright, you, you go do whatever. Yep. Whatever, dude. The ancient, the air, a voice, huh? Alright. Where's, uh. Go talk to these schmucks. I'll catch up because I want to craft an hour again. Yeah. Hey, the chest. We had right, refreshed. <laughs> I'll just start walking to the fucking scarecrow. Oh man, that means I don't get the holy hand grenade now. I'm sad. Uh. It's an unfortunate day for, for Valve when he didn't get that. Oh, there's a chest here, actually. Fasten tight. We are ready to go again. Having beast down here when they're gonna flank us? I mean, sure, if you want. I'll have him up there. Okay. I mean, that guy's AoE shit, so... Didn't get in the blood. Whatever. Yeah, that's the problem. Wait, I hit him? <laughs> yeah, it's... He only has, like, a... I mean, he has a lot of evasion, but... Alright. <clears throat> Take him far away from this place. Put him in like like the fucking lower fields or something. Don't tell me where to put him. Who do you think I am? Let's see, where's some nice low ground? Oh, oh, hello. This looks like prison. Oh, but he can fly. Hmm. Okay, no, I gotta put him somewhere else then. Fuck, this is actually really hard. Uh, fucking stop being bad. Best I can do so I can just fly back, but I think we're out of his range now. I mean, it's fine, because I can get my magic armor back next turn. Pretty easily. You don't have to give me- I, I can either drink a potion or something else. Like, well, this gives Christmas us an opportunity- to turn. We'll get to block oh, I know what to do, I know what to do, hang on, hang on. 
Uh, you're not in range of this, but I think you'll be fine. Does that thing that gives us magic armor per turn? Yeah, but I think it's not really worth it right now, actually. Okay. I mean, I can I can fly up there when, when it's my turn. I'll do an encourage, and I'll do power infusion on my dude because I need the abilities. Asshole. Better bless. Oh, come on. I can't hit that. I guess I'm just shame walking <laughs> over that. Did someone say shame walking? So I'm going to save it because I can actually probably knock him down next turn. Yeah, it doesn't help us this turn. Not a lot helps us this turn. What's the chance of this to hit? Let's find out. Hey! You did it. What about this? You did it again. Fuck. Look at this way, it's hurting your health, it doesn't matter. Your, your magic armor matters. <laughs> Fucking my health doesn't matter. Fucking shit cut. Just tell it as it is, boy. Fuck, why do I have so many arrows in my fucking hotbar? I gave you some new ones. Uh, well, I, I, think it, I think it's just because we didn't do the fight again, and then, like, I didn't fucking reset this. Because I reorganized your <laughs> fucking stash. Alright. Let's do... So you lost. Yeah, we always lose, though. That's what we're best at. Should I try and just kill this guy outright, or should I knock him out? Ah, let's try and kill this guy outright. Let's say Blizzard. Uh, if you can knock, if you can disable the big guy in the side over there, can you reach him? No. All right. Uh, well, I got executed. Right. You want to one me, boy? Alright, so, should I heal myself, or should I, you yeah, know, I, I... You definitely need magic armor above everything else right now. Well, you're gonna use that little spell, right? Uh, you're not in range of it, so you're gonna yeah, get in range yeah, of it. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get in range of it, don't worry. Okay, you how, have to, how like, close right do close. I have to be? Like, uh, how close? Reference, you're just, uh, you're just out of range of it. Okay. If you were, like, standing right there, you'd be in range of it. Alright, right, right, I'll, I'll do that, don't worry. Battle stomp. Are you fucking for real? Because you're cursed, don't worry about it. Man. I probably should take off this regen spell, to be honest. It's f fucking worthless. Right. You're frightened, but I can fix that. The beast is frightened, but that's bad. No, my source point! Sorry, it wasn't done taking his 15 turns, you know, you understand? Okay. Alright, so this won't give you a lot of magic armor, but it'll be enough. And then I can give you clear minded. I know you don't have to, do you? you still, you're still you're still frightened. Okay. Why well, is there no turn counter on it? I mean, Beast is frightened though. Yeah, but I can't. If I give him clear minded, he's still got. He's got no magic armor. Okay. Hmm. Ah. <sighs> I have a Honestly, feeling, we need to teleport him away again. I have a feeling this guy... Well, Sibiel can teleport him, but I have a feeling that this guy is gonna fucking, like, terrify Red Prince again. We'll see how this goes down. We didn't we didn't knock out enough of them, in my opinion, but... Well, yeah, see, I think we should probably just, like, nuke him. Let's give you a bit more. That's all I can do. Oh, boy, I'm terrified now. Yeah, you wanna just load it? No, no, no. I, I have up well, you don't understand. My incarnate's afraid. Beast is afraid. No, You're I, afraid. Yeah, actually, I, yeah, we're fine. Fuck it. Nothing <laughs> happened. <laughs> yeah, don't worry about it. Well, uh, how the fuck do you want to change this approach, dude? <laughs> what do you want to how change? How about I don't teleport the dude away, we just nuke him. With 90% dodge? 90% dodge. I'll find a way to get rid of it. <sighs> All right. Let me. Let me. Like, actually, I can cast that spell, so we can see what gets rid of it. 
Let's get rid of evasion. Doge. How do you get rid of Doge? Maybe slowing. Because, yes, I would love to fucking nuke that guy from fucking orbit, but yes. Okay, come on, are you here? I'm not there. Uh, I'm coming in now, though. Target group too far away. What the fuck are you talking about? Okay, um, favorable wins. Uncanny evasion. So I'm going to cast this now, I'm just going to cast it on random red prince. What removes it? No, I didn't say anything removes it. Fucking, let me look this up then. So I, I, I'm actually curious about that. I mean, would spells evade? I have no idea. How does this work? Oh, here we go. How do you? How do I get rid of evading on enemies? The evasion buff goes away after a turn or two. Magic, magic still works. It's only physical things that, that cause the evasion. Yeah, but we are all physical. Yeah. That's a disadvantage. So, uh, one thing that we could do is if we had Polymorph, there's a skill called Spider's Legs. It reduces the dodge by 70%. But we don't have that. I don't have Spider's Legs. Let me get rid of the fucking reju rejuvenation thing. One second. Get rid of that. Uh, Condor will not help here. Uh, Medusa head. No. The wind is a gentle kiss. Come. Feed. Set bleed fire for three turns. <clears throat> I, you know what? I, I have an idea. I, I What's have, your idea? I have a bit of an idea. What? Why don't I start the fight with Red Prince, and then just have him like fucking back up? Why, why are we starting it up here? Let's let's just go somewhere else. So let's go like over here or something. See ya. I will just. Sure. I will only start the fight with Red Prince. Let's come on over. I'll even bring Beast over there. Yeah, so Sabil's in range from here. The sun is I'll still like Sabil so I have the same and, kind of range stuff. And what? what? Red yeah, whatever, let's just do this. A sudden. the friend. Shh. Alright. Sorry. Right, I can teleport him. Like, let me see if I can teleport him somewhere, like, you legit. Wanna, you wanna do it right now, or? Well, I don't know, because I think it's like. I'm just, I'm just looking at my options up before I try it in the fight. I don't think I have good, good options. I have I have peace of mind. I'm gonna keep that on me instead of using it on myself, honestly. Yeah, if I from here I can't really teleport him anywhere. Interesting. All right. I guess I'll have beast over there still. No, because I'm just gonna I'm gonna run away as Red Prince as soon as it's my turn. So they have to come to us. Uh, but if, it, if like immediately on your turn you get terrified. Well, then I will. Peace of mind myself, or like fucking, I don't know. Not sure, alright. Don't worry. There's a plan in motion here. Let's just go. So oh, we're good. not in the fight right now. Oh, we're not? It's okay, Red Prince is fine. Okay, now we're in the fight. Alright. Red Prince is not fine. Look, he did actually run away. Don't, don't worry about it. Red, Red Prince is... He likes this. Don't worry. He'll, he'll just be the fucking whipping boy, okay? While the rest of us, like, snipe out that guy. I mean, I wish I'd maybe use death resist on him, but the, I can't use death resist on him. <laughs> I mean, can, can, can we fucking... I think I huh? You don't think what? Here's the thing. I think if I res you, you'll still be... Frightened because I just got to try my right, uh, right. I was out of combat somewhere. That's gonna be my turn, but I can put you at the bottom of the road. You'll probably okay. still be in combat, but you won't be f frightened. Why don't you put a smoke bomb up so they have to now? Then I can't shoot them. D again, that's like that's what do you want me to do? Yeah. All right. This this may not be going as well as I thought, but let's let's see this through at least. Let's, let's see what happens. 
We are frightened. There you go. Probably gonna die still. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, I still got my turn actually, so I could, I'll just I'll just drink a large potion and I'll be fine. Does this count as a spell? Yeah, that would be a spell. Well, I'll save the rest of his points. All right. Um, so you could maybe try and get a lucky arrow on him, but I'm. Mm. I mean, arrow spray probably counts as a spell. But I don't know. I don't think it's worth. I don't think it's worth. Because um, if we like the pro the problem with this fight is this guy. If we kill this guy, we'll have an easier time of it. Huh. See, here's the thing I was thinking of. I was thinking of doing Carmelian Cloak or whatever the fuck, right? And then I was going to open up the next turn and blow him up, maybe. What do you think about that? That might work. They can't move your magic arm if they can't see you. Yeah. That might be, that might be the play. So is there any buffs I want to put on myself before no, right now? Uh, adrenaline? No. Trying to think of what else there is here. I don't think I really have much else for buffs. Maybe I'll just like drink a one potion, a medium wits potion. What else is there? Medium finesse potion. Yeah, we'll just maybe just drink that. It gives me some damage. All right, and then I'm gonna poke myself. Man, I wish, I wish Beast wasn't uh, so far back. I think the same before thing all the time. Before you even complain, <laughs> you told me to put him there this time. Fuck off. I didn't tell you anything. Sure you didn't. I mean, this might be my best option. I mean, you should... Just get this up and then get my ability up and then... I mean, I'm kind of worried about them focusing it. FN now, but... I just need to disable the big guy. If I can disable the big guy, even get to turn before then, I can then buff my guy. I think this is the play. Oh, so this is what Beast lives for. He loves it. Alright, let's try Battle Stomp. Let's, let's just try it. Oh, wait, no. Chicken Claw, it's a spell. Yeah. Eat shit. Oh, well, you did it. Alright. He still has a terrifying aura, though, so don't get too close, but at least he won't be a problem. Uh, I mean, if I go up there, I'm gonna rip it, rest in pieces, so... I mean, you should have a magic armor potion, if not. I, uh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna just give myself wings and then skip turn. So I'll have six turns, hopefully after we blow this guy up. Except he's kind of running towards... <laughs> he approached and speared you! That's, that, that's fine, don't worry about it. I, I, I'll be able to blow him up now, as soon as Sabiel has, has her turn. Tempted to haste Sabeel, but I feel like that might reveal us, so I'm not gonna do that. I, I know she—it's not gonna do anything for her. Any? Well, actually, it would, but yeah, fuck it. Don't worry about it. Actually, give my dude fast light infusion. I doubt I'll do it. Now. That's fine. See, so the like, the thing is with that is like the first turn, he 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 has a lot of magic armor to begin with, so you can't exactly blow him up with the magic spells, anyways. So it's damned yeah. if you do, damned if you don't. That's just like, I think it's just a tactician difficulty thing. You have to see deal this with helps. them for one turn. Let's just experiment. Like, will it go away on your turn? Or we have a turn of being feared? Like, what, what's up here? Uh, I'm gonna guess turn of being feared, but, you know. Turn of torture draw? Yeah. Both of them are this. No. Okay, so I'm gonna spend a point to move. See, the only thing I don't like is the fact I'm right side FN, so if there's any kind of splash damage, they're gonna hit me too. We'll see. But he, as soon as it gets to Seville's turn, he's guaranteed dead. I don't think they have that much splash. I think the only one that splash is the big guy. Maybe he's terrified now, but it's fine, whatever. As I said, I think he'll go away after a turn. Yeah. No, you're still terrified. I, I still have clear. I, I still have clear mind. Don't worry. 
Just yeah, focus on killing this kills fucker. Okay, it is. Oh, we're all, we're all fine now. Yeah, it's gone. Yeah, that's what I thought. All right. Although it that, that's kind of funky how that worked. That's weird. Yeah, I know. Because it applied terrified, but oh, what? Don't don't think about it too hard. All right, let's just minimize losses. There we go. I got two of them. So that was that was actually the play was to have Sabeel kind of like basically blow him up. Even though she can she can't really do that on the first turn because of the evasion. I can teleport. No, I can't really teleport. Hmm. I could give you some evasion. Actually, I can teleport you in if you want. Um, no, because I have wings. It's fine. Oh, of course. Ah, uh, fuck it. Totem. So, this is this is one of those interesting things, though. So, Sabeel's wits aren't very high. I maybe should get them highest in the party so she gets to go first and blow up stuff. But then again, it, you're, yeah, actually, that's that's how it goes because it's round robin. Like a few points in wits, just so she goes before everybody else and is able to do things like that. Because the thing is, we were waiting for her until the very end of that. Actually, I'm starting to think that actually, just just like, yeah, like I'll like we'll see who has the highest wits in the party, and then I'll I'll put wits higher than that maybe. I mean, all my cags have wits. I mean, but you but have he it from actually, items. You can already see. You can already see. Oh yeah. Like Beast has 19 and Ifan has 24. Why? Uh, other reasons. Also, the initiative. Just like I like going first. I uh, found it. Like, okay, it's important for Ifan because he's a buffer. I, no, no, it's really. I mean, the thing is, Sabeel blows up people on the first turn. I mean, I'll take a few points out. Because that's the, that's the whole reason we. Okay, fine. Ethan buff people the first turn, but that when the second round comes in, then she's at she's at the end. That's a problem. Your problem. Yeah, yeah, exactly. What the fuck? Does, so, why so is this guy up there? Did, did you actually invest into wits, or is it just gear? Um, invested into it, because... Why? For one, spotting things. Other things, just initiative in general. I mean, yeah, I guess it's round robin, but I'd still like to go first. Yeah, but you're literally competing with me. Yeah, and? You're the reason Sabeel's going last, and why Se Beast basically got, no, like, hit. No, you're the reason Sabeel's going last, my buddy. Yeah, well, it's because I didn't invest into as much into wits. I, I didn't realize, but it doesn't do anything for spells for you. You're not doing more damage with that. It you, it doesn't unless you went for the spell crit talent. I mean, I don't really need anything else. Yeah, intelligence. Uh, your shit skills based upon intelligence. So you're supposed to really put it doesn't. into. It doesn't. What? All right. Well, I mean, I buff like the only thing that scales of intelligence I do is healing. So yes, maybe I should put more in intelligence. Maybe. Okay, I, I can barely get into range for this. Fuck, I'm just gonna go forward a bit. But okay, so why does why does Beast have so much wits then? Actually, Beast doesn't have a lot of wits. He just had some. He has more than Sabeel does. Sabeel has none. All right, first of all, buddy. Yeah, you should. What the fuck? Like, how do you have 17? I have fucking 10. Because you took everything out of wits. You tanked it. What the hell? I missed. Am I cursed? Nah, I just did just being casual. So. But did you. Did you keep some in there? What did you do? What do you mean that I keep some in there? Like, how does he have so much fucking bullshit? Also, I can't. I can't see this guy. So, maybe I'll. Uh... Is there any, any other guys or no? Oh yeah, there's one more guy over there. All right. Did you invest into wits for beast? I mean, I wouldn't say invest. I just put some in it. Oh my I lord! I mean, granted, I might want to take some out because it's round robin. Oh my lord. I, no wonder you don't, you don't have to make everything worthless. out like it's a fucking failure, dude. 
I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Like, I get that you're saying, you're trying to tell me this is not the most optimal thing I could be doing, but you don't have to be a dick about it. <laughs> okay, alright, alright, chill, chill. Let's not get mad at each other. It's fine. I mean, I'm not, I'm not at the press of being mad. Okay, I... I, I just, I just want, like, dude, people are yelling so at me for this like, kind of oh shit. man, oh man, Mike, I'm done. It's like, like, no, dude, you're being kind of a dick I, right I was just, now. I was, what, no, I was wondering why Sabiel was going dead last. I'm like, yeah, because you know I, I you missed know it out here, of here, it. Here, here, I know, to, I know to solve everything. Eat shit. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Wait, what? Heal him? What, what are you doing? Okay, I cast healing ritual on you to hurt you, and okay. it bounced and hit the scarecrow. Uh... Yeah, fuck it. I still think someone should have high, should have, someone should have high wits. Well, I mean, I guess I'm gonna go back and put that back in because I, like, it had some other unforeseen circumstances with me fucking taking all, all the shit out of wits, so. Mostly the fact that, like, I, I was able to blow up people before, but now it's actually detrimental that I can't go first. Especially if you're competing with me for wits, so... Which is, it doesn't make any sense, but, you know... Because you have, I mean, you have wits one, on characters is, that don't even benefit on it. It, it, it is it. the spotting uh, one, so... That's why I like it. Yeah, but, like... And just at the time when I was putting into wits for Ethan, I was like, yeah... I don't have any spells that scale with intelligence, really. I mean, Fine. weapons do. I also, I was in the impression that initiative was more initiative-y. The fact that it's round robin, like, it's because, like, the way it, like, is at the end where, like, everyone else goes last. It's just because, like, no, that there's no more enemies to go in between. Wait, why is Path interrupted? Oh. So initiative is kind of dumb that way. Kind of is, yes. But, what can you do? It's like, wits for crits and... Spotting, that's it. Why is this like constantly path interrupted? I can't hit that guy. Yeah, that essentially just means that if you if you know what the highest wits check is in the game for like spotting shit, like you have no reason to go beyond it. I mean if you like crits then it works. Well, but, but even then like, we just that <laughs> we were just like, does it raise crit mod modifier or the damage modifier? Yeah, I'm just seeing where I'm gonna go get the driftwood field, so... Uh, waypoint maybe, and then I'll... Actually, no, I'll just go respec it now. It's fine, let's just finish this fight first, and then end the episode. End the episode, yeah. Yeah. Like, I, I actually... I didn't know you were doing that, because I, I always, like, min-max my characters, like... Red Prince is very much like Strength Constitution, there's nothing else he does. And memory whenever I need it. Well, that's the problem, like, with, with Beast, yeah, I've, like, gone heavy into Strength and Con, and just some because we're like, yeah, you should have high initiative, you want to hide a good initiative. But seeing as initiative doesn't really matter, I'll spec him out of it. Alright. Uh, anyways, thank you very much for watching, guys. I will respect Sabeel a little bit. Maybe Red Prince.